All right, hello everybody. Welcome back to the Rocket Review. Today's video, we're going to be reviewing the Estes Patriot missile. So here's the completed rocket with the recommended paint scheme on here. Got all the decals on, and these decals are stickers, not the type you would uh, dip in water and apply to the rocket. Um, so let's start with the bottom. Uh, we have our 18 millimeter motor mount, so you can launch it on A, B, and C's, although the kit doesn't recommend A's, so B's and C's. Um, it has a hook to keep the motor in there. Um, so let's uh, move up. So we got uh, the, here's something I do want to mention, is we have a 1 8 inch launch lug here, and it's uh, towards the kind of lower middle of the rocket, and it did actually conflict with the stickers because this uh, it has vinyl in between the black stripes, so we actually had to cut out some of that vinyl so that the sticker would fit on there. Um, so just word of warning, you'll have to probably do that if you want your sticker to fit on there. Uh, moving up on the rocket, if we check out the recovery system here, uh, we do have made a couple modifications that aren't in the kit. Um, it has a 12 inch parachute, and then of course our usual modifications are a, a swivel to prevent tangling on the parachute, and a Kevlar shock cord because that uh, tends to be more durable than the regular elastic that the kit comes with. So uh, let's go try it out. Uh, on the recommended motors, it should go about 600 feet on a C motor, so it should be pretty fun. Let's go fly it. Yeah, not bad. It's coming down. Upside down. Hard to see what happens. Must have got wrapped up. All right, Patriot, second flight on a B64. So after the two flights we did on the Patriot, uh, I think I'm going to give this one a score of 3.5 out of 5, uh, simply because, uh, then again, I mentioned the sticker is off, and then also it, uh, I think really with most rockets this size, they do better with the 24 millimeter motor mount, because it seemed like the C and the B weren't enough to really get it up as high as it would, uh, it would do better on a D. And then also what did happen is the parachute broke, so we replaced it with a nylon parachute, um, which that's generally just a little better because the plastic ones aren't as high quality. Um, but otherwise, it was a really good rocket. It flew well. It did fly a little, uh, wind cocked a little bit, but that's to be expected with the wind that we had today. So overall, 3.5 out of 5, it's a good rocket. 